All right, this is a three monitor hookup system for the HP Thunderbolt G2. This right here, Thunderbolt G2. And it is connected to three screens. I'm gonna show you what I mean. Uh -huh. How you do that, I will let you know. And now we're going to show you how to download the correct uh, drivers for your video card. Um, Got to go to the website. It is going to be displaylink.com forward slash downloads forward slash Mac OS. And that will take you to the website that's going to display the right ones. Don't click the display link manager. I mean, I didn't. Um, I'm using Mac OS Catalina. So Catalina, I mean, choose the driver that actually works for yours. Mine is 10.15.5. So under legacy releases, I'm going to go back and look for the Catalina 10.15. And I'm just going to do the 5.25 because that's what worked for me, the 5.26. Um, didn't work I'm doing it a different like workaround thing but I think the 5.25 for the or the 5.26 um, will work so you're gonna get a, a download right there open it up and it'll pop up the um, installer software there it is open it up come on there you go. So display link software installer. Open that up. Run through the regular shebang bang. And make sure you reset your computer. Okay. Now we're going to show you how to set up the settings. Go to uh, system preferences. And it'll show you the privacy. Go to security and privacy. Open that up then you scroll down to where it says screen recording and make sure that display link user agent is checked off you might need to unlock it in order to check it but you need to check that off otherwise it won't work okay I disconnected everything from the USB port and have this one um, USB extender that has a HDMI port right there so it's a very cheap it's only meant for one monitor so I'm gonna download this let me put it right here into one of the USB and it will read it boom right you have to go from here to there to get the first uh, extended monitor before you put the second monitor now this HDMI cable that goes from this USB hub goes straight to this monitor. So I did have to remove the USB cord that was going from this HP G2 to this um, monitor and I hooked it up to the, U the HDMI cord going from here to there. Yes, it's not perfectly hooked up with that, but I tried it every way that I was able to look and I couldn't find it, couldn't find a way to get it working except for this way. So this monitor is still hooked up to this one, right? You have to do this first separately, otherwise it won't read the, the second extended monitor. Now, here is the cord coming from the G HP G2 Thunderbolt. Plug it in here. Looks like it's opening boom and then we'll grab this thing and as you can see it's working on all three now let's say you got all three monitors hooked up but something's not right 
when you move something from your laptop to the second one, it goes fine. And you move it to the third one, it doesn't go. But when you move it to the right, let's say, boom, it's all right there. That's not right, right? It means the arrangement is off. So you gotta do is go to system preferences and then go to displays and see how this middle one is a laptop. So these ones are incorrect because the laptop's in the middle, it should be to the right. So let's grab this one. So you click that, it's red. When I click over here, it's red. That means that that's this little box is that monitor. And that one's all the way to the left. So we gotta move it to the left. Boom. Now, when I drag this box to the left, it goes to the second and now to the third monitor. You see? So, there you go. Now it all works the correct way. You just had to use this little adapter and unplug the HDMI from this one. The G2 and this one are not connected. The HDMI from this laptop going there is connected. And then this one going from here to the little USB-C is connected. And you'll have it like this. No, it's not perfect, but you know what? I got it to work. If you like this, share it, like it, and subscribe. Thank you. Have a good day.